This is the Lister Thunder. It's the new supercar from the people who brought us the utterly nuts storm in the 1990s. Which wasn't far short of a L.E. man's car for the road. This, though, is a tuned Jaguar F-Type. We'll forgive you a little disappointment. Lister's history lies in faster, racier Jags, mind, it's Nobla race car having D-Type roots. This Thunder not only has a name that rips off the storm, but more power than its 90s forebear, too. The F-Type supercharged 5.0-liter V8 has been wound up to a symbolically evil 666 bhp, a near 100 bhp hike on the most powerful production F-Type, propelling the Thunder from 0 to 60 miles per hour in 3.2 SECS, 0 to 100 miles per hour in 6.8 SECS and onto a 208 miles per hour top speed. Perhaps not surprisingly, given those punchy performance figures, the Thunder is all-wheel drive. Lister boss Lawrence Whitaker says 666 bhp on the rear wheels is just too much I think, I want my customers alive to buy again. He says more power still is possible. But 666 bhp is a sensible figure to peg the engine that to keep its reliability. We'll see the thunder in full at February's historic Motorsport International in London. Just 99 will be built, priced from £139,950. It's nearly £30,000 more than an F-Type SVR. But you do get a new carbon body kit. Making more downforce than standard, and a choice of 36 colors of Napa leather inside. Yikes. The exterior decals and color highlights will match what you picked inside. You can option a carbon bonnet if you're feeling frivolous. While existing F-Type owners who aren't bothered about the extra power can order a retrofit carbon. Body kit from Lister for £19,950. Although we are not directly affiliated with Jaguar Land Rover. Lister has a Jaguar tuning heritage dating back 65 years, says Whitaker. Like Brabus and AMG with Mercedes and Alpina with BMW. We are hoping to become synonymous once again with tuning Jaguar vehicles. Giving customers new enhanced. Bespoke performance and design alternatives to Jaguar's acclaimed model program. If you're concerned Jag's own SVO department already does that, then consider Lister's stillborn plans to build a 1,000 bhp hypercar. Whitaker told us all about it a few years ago, and says cars like the Thunder are an important step to its existence. We need 10 to 15 million pounds to complete a working hypercar prototype. He tells us, and we are hoping the Thunder can help generate some of this capital. The long-term goal is to have Lister tuning packages on every model in the Jaguar range. Like what you hear.